So after taking another look through this uh, assembly guide and looking ahead at step two, turns out the initial video we actually built two of these that had you know uh, both the hub and the uh, the heck, uh, connected to the hex shaft as well as the pinion gear. What we did was we made one of each like this instead. So I'm not sure if you can actually see that, but notice that now we have these two like this. Okay. They don't have another back part to them like we had in the other one. So one of each, and that's going to be used for one side. I'm assuming that we'll probably have another one on the other side of some sort. I'm not sure just yet, but we'll find out as we go. Um, nope, doesn't look like it. So it looks like we only need one for now. Okay, great. So this looks like it'll be the centerpiece, and it'll be holding together a bunch of gears. The one with the actual... Uh, with the actual gear hub and the, the lock screw there, and it's gonna probably gonna go through here, I'm assuming, like such. So we'll get into that now. Okay, so let's start off. So we're gonna start looking at how we gotta build this. So we're gonna need a bunch of these guys over here. Now, what's good about this kit is that um, it looks like both sides are very similar. So we might run into similar setups. Okay. So, these guys, we're going to start plugging in these little gold things here. So it appears that we need to have three there. That's all I'm seeing. I don't see anything there for the... Oops, these guys come right out. So you can see we put those there. Now does the other side take them? They certainly do. So the other side is going to take three also. Let me move this one out of the way for now. And we have two. And we have three. Let's see, that one doesn't really go in there now, does it? Uh, looks like we're not going to put any there. Ah, third one's going to go in the center. There we go. So like so. Okay. So here's the outside piece. Here's the inner piece. Okay. Inner. Outside. Okay, so that part's there. So now we're going to have another hex shaft. This looks like it might be the smaller. Nope, it's a larger one. And that's going to be used to go here somehow. Okay. So let's see. Okay, so we're going to take the one that has the uh, gear hub and the, with the grub screw. And we're going to connect it to a couple of these gears here. Now here it says they're labeled. So they have a G3, a G2, and a G1. So let's see. Which one here is G1? It's G2. And there's actually a number on it. There's another G2. Here's a G1. And this is G3. Alright, so we have two G2s, a G3, and a G1. The G1 is going to go towards the inner portion, which is this one here. G2's in the middle. There are two G2's and then a G3. Now the G3 has a hex part on one side. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and slip that one through first with the grub screw in the notch that's located on that gear like so. Okay. See that there? Alrighty. So we have that. Then we're going to connect one of these here onto the shaft. Oops, it's going to go there. It looks like that's all that's going to go on these. Now we're going to take the next shaft. Uh, let's see here. So this shaft now, I believe it's circular because they're not calling it out as a hex shaft. So these are probably going to go through here. So we're going to take the, which one's G1 now? That's G2, that's going to go on the outside. 
and G1 is this one here. So those are going to go there. Oh, I see what's saying, and then these are connect somehow. Some way. I'm just kind of giving it a quick test to make sure. Okay. Okay, so that's going to go in there. So this goes in the further hole that's on this unit. So as you can see, whoops. So let's just do that over again. We put the two metal, three metal pieces here, and there's one more without a metal piece. That's where we're going to put the round one through. So let's put that through again. Okay. So that's in place. Okay, I'll just hold it there for now. And this one's going to go through the first one here. Not sure if you can see it or not. It's going to go through that one in there. Like so. Alright, so yeah, we can kind of see how this is going to work out. Alright, so let me just kind of put that there. Now, next spot, we're going to have to take one of these guys here. This one's going to go on the top here. And then we're left with this guy. And that's going to go on the next one. Okay, and then sure enough, it fits right in. So this looks like it might be the first axle. Now, have we missed anything here? Nope, we've captured it all. So now what we're going to do is, we're just going to kind of tilt this on the side, hoping that nothing falls out, and move this over so that we can slide everything right into it. it. Might be a better idea, actually, now that I think about it. Let's put this like that. Put this back up. Kind of balance it there. Another piece. I'm going to take these off, and I'm just going to actually and I'm going to run them through already to make it easier to put this together. So if you can't see, this is actually going mounted on. The hex shaft here, the circular shaft here in the middle, and that plastic component that we put towards the top, and then that's it. Then we're going to come back and we're going to mount this guy. Now let's make sure we do it right. So sure enough, we got to get the other guy, this guy here. Okay. And this time we're just kind of feeding this around here. Does that make sense? Oops, this one doesn't take one. This one does here. Okay. It's a little tricky to put on. In fact, one of my pieces already fell out. That's expected with one of these. Uh, kind of expected with this. So, looks like we got it more or less in place. However, it's not sitting right for me. So I'm going to try to figure out why. Let's take this off again. Okay, so we have this off here. 
And I have a feeling it's related to this part right here. So I'm just going to slightly loosen it and give it a turn so that I can just slide it up a smidge. Okay. back. Enough, we're still having some problems here putting this all together. It's not necessarily the easiest thing to put together here. So let me just turn that one more. Getting to make it. 